class, today we will have our new topic to be discussed. So before we proceed, I want to ask you one question. Class, what are your favorite colors? Yes, pink. How about from grade 4? Blue, green, yellow, and yellow green. So are your favorite colors present in these colors that I have posted here? Yes, very good. Some of your favorite colors are here. So now, what are we going to do is to put these colors and identify whether the color belongs to primary, secondary, or tertiary colors. So now, the first color that we have is red-violet. So, where do you think this red-violet belongs? Okay, so this belongs to tertiary colors. How about the violet? Anyone from grade 3? Yes, violet belongs to secondary colors. So, how about blue? We are here from grade 4. Yes, very good. The blue belongs to primary colors. How about yellow? Yes, yellow also belongs to the primary colors. So, how about the red orange? Very good. Red orange belongs to the tertiary colors. Now, so how about the yellow orange? From grade 3, please. Yes, yellow orange belongs to the tertiary colors. Now, how about the yellow green? Yes, very good. Yellow green belongs to tertiary colors also. So now, how about the orange? Grade 4. Yes, orange belongs to the secondary colors. Now let's proceed to red, guys. Yes, very good. Color red is one of the primary colors. How about the color green? Anyone from grade 3? Yes, color green belongs to the secondary colors. Now how about the blue green? From grade 4? Yes, blue green is one of the tertiary colors. Now the last one, blue violet. Which do you think blue violet belongs? Yes, blue violet is also one of the tertiary colors. So now we already have all the colors pasted and primary colors, secondary, tertiary colors. So the primary colors are blue, yellow, red, and the secondary colors are violet, orange, and green. And the tertiary colors are red violet, red orange, yellow orange, yellow green, blue green, and blue violet. Class, our topic for today is all about a color wheel. What is a color wheel? Any idea? None. So, a color wheel is a circular diagram of the spectrum used to show the relationship between the colors. It shows how colors relate to each other and visually demonstrate the relationship between primary, secondary, and tertiary colors. But class, did you know that a color wheel is a circular or round chart of colors that has 12 equal parts? The basic primary colors are red, blue, and yellow. They are placed in the wheel that a triangle is formed. If you mix these primary colors, you can come up with other different colors. So as I said a while ago that the primary colors are the red, blue, and yellow. So if you mix those colors together, you can come up with a new color. Okay, so I have here some pictures. I want you to answer what I am going to ask. So, what is the color of the dress of this party? Very good. Red. How about this car? Blue. Very good. How about this one? Yellow. Very good. So, red, blue, and yellow are the primary colors. When we say primary colors, this refers to the basic colors that can be mixed together to produce other colors. So as I said, primary colors are red, blue, and yellow. So now, how about this picture? 
What color is this? Green. Very good. How about this one? Orange. Very good. This one? Violet. The color of the eggplant is violet. So, those three colors are considered as the secondary colors. When we say secondary colors, this refers to the colors that made by mixing two primary colors. So, secondary colors are the result of mixing two primary colors. Again, what are those primary colors class? Okay, red, blue, and yellow. If you mix those two primary colors, you can come up with secondary colors. Okay, so now, let's proceed to the tertiary colors. Tertiary colors. Tertiary colors are combinations of primary and secondary. So, as I said, primary are those red, blue, and yellow. And then the secondary one are those green, orange, and violet. If you put together one primary colors and one secondary colors, the result is tertiary colors. Okay. So, tertiary colors are red, orange, red, violet, yellow, green, yellow, orange, blue, violet, and blue, green. So now, to further discuss this color wheel, we will use the formula of colors so that I can elaborate more or discuss more how these colors come up with their colors in order in mixing. So, primary colors, as I said, are basic colors, so there is no need for mixing. So, I have here blue color. This is blue. This is yellow. And this is red. So as I said, these three colors are primary colors. So now, I have here a graph. So this circle will represent all the primary colors. And this square will represent all the secondary colors. And these triangles will represent the tertiary colors. So now, since primary colors needs no mixture, only the color itself. So now, let us put here the color red so this is the red one so there is no mixing needed and then next is the yellow one so where is the yellow class so the yellow is here so we will put this one here okay again what is the last color of the primary colors class very good blue so now we will put the blue here here so blue. now class are all those primary colors already in the chart yes very good red blue and yellow are already here so now let us proceed to the secondary colors again class what are those secondary colors that I have mentioned a while ago? Orange, green, violet. Very good. Those three colors are considered as the secondary colors. So now, secondary colors are a mixture of two primary colors. So in order for us to come up with secondary colors, we are going to mix two primary, primary colors. The yellow, the red, and the blue. So now, let us go first for the orange. So, class, how can you come up with the orange one? So, orange is a combination of red and yellow. So now, we will use this plastic for us to come up with the color. Okay? The red and the yellow. So, if we mix those two colors, the red and the yellow, you will come up with the orange. So, is that visible for you now, class? Okay, very good. So, the red plus yellow will come up with the orange. So, now, the result is orange. We will now put this in the chart. Okay. So, where is the orange, class? Here, right beside me. Okay. 
see? Orange. The combination of red and yellow will come up with an orange color. Okay. Now, what will be the next colors? Next is green. Green color is composed of blue and yellow. So, where is the yellow? Here. Yellow. The yellow. And the blue. to come up with the exact color it should be balanced the color yellow and blue should be balanced for it to have the correct result okay so let's mix this well add to add some yellow okay so now we have color green. Color green from color yellow and blue. Okay, we will now paste this here. Is that clear class? Blue plus yellow is equals to green. Now, what's next? Blue plus red. What do you think is the result class? Okay, violet. So, we'll have again another plastic for the show. Okay, we have here the red. And the, we should mix this one. Okay, again class, what is the result of blue and red? Okay, violet. So what is the color of this color I have here? Yes, violet. So now, since we have this color, we can put this here. Violet. Okay, violet. Now, the secondary colors are already here. Orange, green, and violet. Orange is a combination of red and yellow. And green is a combination of blue and yellow. And the last one, violet, is a combination of blue and red. So now, let us proceed to the tertiary colors. Again, class, what makes a tertiary color? Yes, very good. Tertiary colors are a combination of one primary color and one secondary color. Now, the first formula that we have here is red plus orange. So since we already have orange that I have used a while ago, I will just add some red in order for us to come up with red orange. So here, red plus orange well become red orange so now we are going to put this color here in the red orange triangle this one see the red orange is darker than the orange here and then next Yellow plus green is equals to yellow green. Okay, since we already have the green here, we will just add some yellow. Yellow 
green. See? It's now yellow green. And so, next will be blue plus violet. So, we already have here the color violet. So, we just need to add some blue for it to come up with blue violet color. Okay. Blue. Mix it together with the violet to come up with blue violet. Okay. So, we are going to put it here. the blue green so in order for us to come up with blue green we were going to add blue from green so since we already have this green here we were just going to add some blue then we're going to mix this one see the result is blue green. So we are now going to put it here. Okay, so the next one will be yellow orange. So since we already have this yeah, orange here, we are just going to add some yellow. Last one will be the red violet. So now I have here color violet. We are just going to add this with color red. Okay, so I have to add some red in order for it to become red violet. Here. This is now red violet. Okay, now we already completed the colors needed in the chart. So again, class, primary colors are those in circle, and secondary colors are those in squares, and those tertiary colors are all in triangles. So now, again, class, what are those primary colors? Red, blue, and yellow. Correct. Those are the primary colors. The red, the yellow, and the blue. And always remember, class, that those primary colors and color will always form a triangle so see they form a triangle now class what are those secondary colors very good so the secondary colors are orange green and violet how about those tertiary colors okay red orange yellow orange yellow green blue green blue violet and red violet so now class any questions or any clarifications okay so now before we end our discussion i have here an answer sheets the first page has different shapes and you will color the heart one the primary colors the star as the secondary colors 
and the sun as the tertiary colors. The another sheet is a color wheel black sheet. So you will color this using your coloring materials. So I will give you 20 minutes to do that. So may I have a representative from grade 3? Okay. Pass this to your classmates from grade 4. Pass this also. So are you through? No more papers? Okay, so that would be all class. Goodbye and thank you for today.